hey, invariably when you start getting a honeydew list, all of a sudden you get different things added on. I've got under counter lights, two bulbs that are burned out, and the garage door was not going up properly. So I gotta look at that too. So I got my work cut out for me. Got some under counter lights here. Those are kind of slick. They installed those when this was a new house and there's one over here that's burned out. That one's not working anymore. Kind of like the under counter light that it gives you, you know, for your counter space. And we've got one over there and there's one here, but in fact, there's two. Now, this one's burned out too. So I'm gonna have to pull those apart, take a look at them. Sometimes you get those and you can plug them in, you know, to a counter plug outlet like that. But usually if you put stuff like this in, it's good to have them hardwired direct on over to a light switch. Okay. I better pull one of those apart and see what I can do about it. And generally those are very tiny little fluorescent bulbs in there. And so, I've got to take it out to get to the store so I know exactly what I need. Don't guess on those. It's kind of hard to see on this, but at first glance, you may look and see there's no trim to get this off. Well, this, this little plastic goodie sometimes is just attached by friction and you just kind of, kind of push it and it's in a little slot there. You push it like that, pull it down. And voila, that's how it comes out. Friction. There's just a little groove on there and that's it. So, you know, know when to be a bull in a china shop and know when not to be. You know, these bulbs, you can swivel them into place. This is the old bulb. Didn't look like it was in all the way. There. And so it is working. So you unscrew it and then you can slide it out. See, it's got prongs on them like that. But it didn't look like it didn't work. And I probably should have the light switch turned off. You kind of put it in there like that and then hold your mouth just right. right, twist it, and then it slips up into place. Okay, go ahead and turn the light switch back on. Mother. Now see there, it's not on. It might have been. That's on. Now it's on. I'm just having to play with it a little bit. And see it's getting black at the end. That tells me it's about ready to be replaced. I could, I could walk away from this and an hour from now or next time you turn the, the switch on, it doesn't work. Yeah. And I'm gonna look at the other one there's another one in here. Here. Yeah. Do you remember how to pull that off? Oh, you push it in. Yeah, you push it in. Here, let me let me see if I can get it. Just carefully sure. push that in. I add it out. I'm not sure I had to do that or not. Uh, one of these out. Yeah. This one's a little bit longer than the other. Just gotta push it in hard. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. Okay. Now, now this one looks burned out. Turn it a little bit. I'm, okay, I'll play with it. So you got to take it out. Yeah, see this one's not... This one is definitely burned out. I'm going to gently pull that out. It's more than the other and one. And the tip is all black and stuff. I'm going to have to get a new one of these at the store. I don't want to make the assumption that the other one is the very same length Close. because you take them see this one here is shorter take them in when you go okay i will this one here go ahead and turn the light switch up pops take it to lowe's take it to lowe's he says that's where i got the other ones okay Ooh, it's kind of warmed up a little bit but turn it back on yeah you can turn it back on now see they have they have different uh different sizes and so I, I don't want to just measure this I want to take it to the actual store yeah. 
and see if they've got this. I think they will have these, but I don't want to make any assumptions and say, oh yeah, I know what size, and then go there and find out the tips are, are different or the diameter is slightly different than these. Okay, so, so my estimation is on this older, on this one here, I think it's about ready to be burned out, even though I played with it and got it to work. I'm gonna take that one in too. Take those two in. Okay. Another little thing to get at the store. Oh, so you think those tubes are about eight dollars? Yes, they're very wow. expensive. Yeah, just because they're small doesn't mean they're cheaper. Usually that means they're more expensive because when's the last time you needed to buy one of these? You know? So that's okay. We'll go to the store and see what they have and however much they cost, we gotta do it. Go ahead.